Hi everyone, it's me Rhonda. I'm the owner of Notorious Nails and this is a custom press-on nail boutique. I have my own website. It's Notorious Nails 20. Uh, do the http dot dot forward slash forward slash Notorious Nails 20 dot com and you have to put that in the search bar or it brings up a Notorious Nails in Glasgow, Scotland. <laughs> so that's not me. Um, and then I also have an Etsy storefront. It's Notorious Nails Custom Boutique, and I sell press-on nails on there. I'm also on Instagram and Facebook, and obviously on YouTube as well, under Notorious Nails 20 or Rhonda Guerra, spelled R-H-O-N-D-A-G-U-E-R-R-A. -R -R -A. I wanted to do this video to reiterate the way that you properly measure your nail plates so that when you order press on nails for me, you get the correct size. Um, there's two ways you can do it. This is one way and I've already pre-measured one of my nails and you just take scotch tape or gift wrap tape and you're going to place it over your nail, pressing it into the nail grooves on the sides. And then you're going to take a fine point Sharpie like this and you're going to draw the lines over the tape that's over your nail. Then you're going to pull the tape off and you're going to put it on your ruler and you can see here my lines for the white and you're going to do the widest part of your nail and my lines you count the millimeter lines on the ruler between the two lines to arrive at the correct amount of millimeters. So I think mine is six six millimeters or seven millimeters for my finger. And the way that I keep track, because you'll lose track if you don't do this properly, is I, let me set that down. I take a piece of paper and a pencil and I draw both of my hands and I put an R above my right hand and an L above my left hand. And once I get the, mil the millimeter size, I write that above this finger and then you write the tip size on the finger and you're gonna do that on all 10 nails. The reason I ask you to give me the millimeter sizes is because if you're not a zero and you're not a one, you're somewhere in between, then you're gonna give me the millimeter size so that uh, I know that that's a custom file. I have to file that custom to fit the size of your nail so that it fits properly. This is gonna give you the best adhesion so that they wear longer and stronger and well. So it's important to do that. The other method of measuring is to take a seamstress. These are like the little, you can get them in the sewing aisles of like Walmart or anywhere that they sell that kind of stuff. Um, and you're just gonna take your little measuring tape and you're gonna put it over your nail and you're gonna go the widest part of your nail and you're gonna do the same thing. Put the first black line in the groove of your nail and then fold it over and put the other line like this. And then you're going to count the millimeters between from groove to groove. And then you'll put that above your drawing of your hand. You put that above the fingernail. Then once you get your measurements down and you know what each size finger is in millimeters, then you're gonna go and you're gonna look at my cards on my YouTube channel, that's what this video is for. And on my cards, this is my coffin nails, and the numbers on the side here, this is your millimeter, how many millimeters it is in the widest part. This is your tip size, this is the length. So these are my coffin tips that I do for press on or glue on nails. So remember the top is your tip size, the side is the millimeters. So you're gonna to need to know both of these in case my zero doesn't fit you. If this isn't the millimeters that you are, then you're gonna give me the correct millimeter size so that I know I have to file this to fit you. So those are the coffins. And then these are my squovels. And then these are long ballerina.
short stiletto. Now these are just tips glued on there. There's no color or anything. They're not pretty. It's just to give you an idea of the sizes that I offer and the millimeters of each one and why it's important to know the difference of those. And then this is my long stilettos. And here's one of each of them, different sizes or different lengths. And you can order them in shiny or you can order them in matte. And I have a very large variety of colors that you can choose from if you just wanted a classic set that are one color, that type of thing, you can order pretty much any color. I also can do hard gel and custom mix colors. I've got a ton of different colored acrylics and glitters and custom mixed glitters. I've got a, an entire box full of foil transfers in every design and color and shape and anything you can imagine. I have a ton of rhinestones and different things that we can decorate them with, different bows and different little doodads you can glue to them and affix them. Um, so just let me know kind of what you're looking for, what shape you want, what your millimeter or your tip size is. I try to keep track of people when they order. I'll, I have a little file card thing and I keep your name and what your tip sizes are and the last date that you ordered from me and that way you can just order from me once you do this measuring that I've showed you and you order from me I have your sizes and your names so all you have to do is just tell me what you need a lot of people order a classic set like pink and white or just nude or soft pink that they could wear for like every day some people will order a classic set plus a uh, bling set so rhinestones and designs and decorations and stuff. Sometimes they have special occasions that they want specific things on their nails. It's really a benefit to have press on nails if for medical people, people in the medical field, they're not allowed to wear nails. So all my nurses, lobotomists, medical assistants, uh, physician assistants, all of you people in the medical field can't wear nails. You could utilize my services for special occasions, take them off, wash your hands and be ready for work. Uh, if you're taking photographs, if you're having family reunions, class reunions, and you just want a short term nail that you can put on, these things are paramount. People who um, you know, are in the military and because of military regulation, they're not allowed to wear nails, but you're going to night in the country or you're going to Sturgis, or you're going to Burning Man, or some sort of festival or something, and for the evening or the next couple of days you want to have nice nails, you could utilize my services and reuse the nails that I make for you. And once you order from me, I'll have your sizes, you can continue to order specific things that you might need. So if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to leave them in the comment. Please like, share, follow me. I'm also on Instagram, Facebook, my website, Etsy, you can purchase these from my Etsy storefront too. Um, send me a message, text me, leave it in the comments if you have questions or anything you'd like to know that I haven't covered. I'd appreciate it. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.